gallbladder disease can come in many forms and affects around 20 million Americans, with up to a million new incidences being diagnosed every year. The most common gallbladder disease is cholecystitis. This describes the inflammation of the gallbladder which leads to pain and tenderness, nausea and vomiting. 90% of all cholecystitis cases are a result of gallstones. These are hardened deposits of bile that form in the gallbladder and cause irritation. Sometimes they can block the vital bile ducts leading to symptoms such as jaundice, diarrhea and severe pain. Blockages from gallstones can also allow infections to develop in the gallbladder. There are instances of gallbladder disease that occur without the formation of gallstones, such as cancerous growths and infections, however these are less common. There are some parts of the population who are more likely to experience a gallbladder disease than others. Those who suffer from obesity, or women, especially those who have had multiple pregnancies, are at a higher risk. Similarly, gallbladder disease is more common amongst people who have had frequent changes in weight, or rapid weight loss, or those already suffering cystic fibrosis or diabetes. While many people can go their whole lives without experiencing the symptoms of a gallbladder disease, not many realize that a majority of the population already has so-called silent gallstones. If we don't take steps to take care of our gallbladder, for many it's a matter of when, not if, we will develop a gallbladder disease.